Mr. Speaker, information provided in the PEI legislature yesterday showed PEI had a, let, a net loss of 1,100 people to out-migration, the highest number in 30 years. Why? Because of the Conservative government's changes to employment insurance that are an attack on the seasonal industries and seasonal workers. Yet the regional minister allowed that young people should move away for better lives. Why does this minister think it's okay for PEI to lose its youth and split families asunder? And why does this minister, why does she champion policies that force Islanders to leave? That's it. The Honourable Minister of Employment and Social Development. Mr. Speaker, that, uh, that demagoguery was complete, unadulterated nonsense. nonsense. Mr. Speaker, <laughs> not one person turning brown, has to right? leave PEI in order to search for available work to qualify for EI. Not one single person, Mr. Speaker. And in fact, our statistics show that fewer than 1% of applicants for EI have not qualified for benefits as a result of the changes this government has made. To the contrary, employers in Atlantic Canada are finding more people working on, in their communities so we don't have to bring in temporary foreign workers for the jobs that are available. This member should apologize for this campaign. <laughs>